Hi guys, this is Richard Yap and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I do my own makeup. Um, since this is the new normal, uh, we haven't had any makeup artists on the set. And today I'm going to be guesting on a show. I'll let you know what show it is when we get there. But uh, before that, we have to do our own makeup because there are no makeup artists on the set na nga because they're trying to limit the number of people who are on the set so that we don't get this uh, COVID. Um, this has affected a lot of people and uh, kawawa talaga yung mga, mga makeup artists and all the others. Well, tayong lahat, you know? Kasi ang daming apektado, daming walang trabaho. So, uh, nakakaawa ang mga tao, mga negosyo are doing so badly now. Um, I think uh, we have to learn how to live with this uh, COVID pandemic learn how to live our lives again pero avoiding the avoiding getting sick no so this is uh, one of the new normal things that we're going to do i'm going to show you how i do my own makeup i've done it before pero now i have to do it on my own now kasi nga new normal tayo i'll show you what i have i have my own uh, makeup kit actually which i bring on the set and eto yon pakita ko sa this is the makeup kit that I bring on the set. Yon, actually iluma na yung yung brush ano ko, lalagyan ng brush ko. I haven't had a, I haven't found a replacement for it yet. And may sarili siyang mirror. And it has its own its own light then, but I have light here, so I don't use it anymore. Um, then I have my powder, whatever brushes, and foundation. Okay, now let's start. Actually, pag nagbablog ako, hindi ako nagbi make up pero. Iba kasi ang ilaw sa studio, so um, it brings out all the imperfections that you have on your face, especially kung may sunspots ka and all that. So we have to cover that up para hindi masyadong uh, ano, kita sa TV. So, um, even though hindi tayo sanay na nag-make up, uh, we have to do it. So, we will start doing it. So first step, put on the base. So, the, yung iba, yung mga makeup artists, inaano nila, binabrush nila ako can just use my own hands first step is the base this is the I'm using a makeup forever step one skin equalizer base hydrating primer so you just rub it all over your face Okay, done. Then we put on the concealer for the spots. Now uh, this is the Shuimura. These are for the small spots that uh, need to be hidden, like sun spots. Counting pimple. Right now it looks like a different color, pero mommy I'm gonna be blending na rin yan. Well, yung skin kasi natin, minsan it's nice, minsan it's not. Especially with uh, if you lack sleep or uh, you've been out in the sun. Um, pag na sun sunburn ka din lalabas din yung mga sunspots mo so we have to be careful we have to put on a lot of uh, sunblock even if you don't think that you'll be out in the sun pero minsan talaga lalabas ka lang sandali grabe yung init ng sunlight the UV rays so uh, you have to take care of your skin Marami na akong sunspots because uh, I play golf. Eh, ang 
init sa labas, di ba? You can also use this for uh, the under eyes para hindi kita yung ano eye bags natin. Wala eh. Genetics to sa akin. Eh. My, my mom had eye bags. So, ako bata pa lang may eye bags na ako. Ngayon, hindi na bag maleta na. Problema sa akin. It's not, it's not really dark. It's just puffy. Puffy eyes. Parang puffy love. Okay, make sure you don't get it into your eyes. For the guys there who want to do their own makeup, ito simple lang ginagawa ko. No? Kasi, there are times in your life that you have to put on makeup, even if, even if you're a guy. Dinodoble ko lang yung ibang ano, spots kasi minsan lumalabas pa rin siya after a while kasi parang nalulusaw yung makeup. Okay. Almost done with the concealer. Parang ang dami kong kinonceal. Parang buong mukha ko na yata. Okay, I've had this makeup for a while now. Uh, yung iba, well, hindi naman... Well, one or two years siguro. Buti hindi nasisira ka agad yung iba. Yung iba, you have to throw away kasi nagda-dry na and all that. Uh, we have the base already. We put on the concealer, and then next is the foundation. This one, I'm using a MAC foundation. I don't have the palette. Yung iba, yung mga makeup artists, may palette sila nilalagay nila doon. Sa akin, dito na lang sa kamay. Okay. I have my own brushes also para iwas sa uh, ano. iwas gumamit ng brushes ng iba. Eh, kailangan din namin kasi uh, we use it everyday. Mahirap naman na makiki, makikigamit ka lang parate. Isa, mahirap lang because we don't know what are what is what is uh, bagay sa skin natin. Eh, eto, natutunan na lang natin sa mga makeup artists. We ask them kung Ano ba dapat gamitin natin? Anong shade? So there's so much makeup out there, guys. And, uh, yung iba rin, hindi bagay sa skin natin kasi nagbe-break out. It's too strong. May ganun. So, you have to find one that fits your skin. Skin type. Ito talaga, hindi masyadong heavy yung makeup nilalagay ko. It's just, to make it look uh, good on screen para hindi lang ano para hindi lang mukhang wala kang makeup pero before I was doing showbiz of course hindi mo ako nagwe makeup my skin was a lot better uh, hindi ako nagwe break out masyado pero since I started using makeup din it, it really affects your skin also Especially pag nag-aaraw-araw ka. Well, siguro, dahil sa kuyat din. Pero, there's nothing better than letting your skin breathe talaga. Hirap itong new normal, no? You have to do everything yourself. But, uh, you have to learn to live with it. Rather ng mga ng magkasakit, di ba? Which is worse. Okay, almost done with the foundation. Yung iba, you have to learn to use the one that blends with your skin. At saka, huwag masyadong malayo naman sa skin tone mo. Kasi, may, makikit, may nakikita ang iba na nagme-makeup. Yung, yung liig nila, medyo, darker than their face. Yung face nila masyadong puting-puti. Which, uh, of course, doesn't look nice. Kasi mukha kang may mask on TV. So, you have to get the one that's 
nearest to your skin color. Ubusin na natin to. Kunti sa ears para mag-match with the color of sa neck. I don't like putting so much on the neck kasi nag-aano sa kwelyo ng ano ng polo. Okay. That's the best I can do. Touch natin konti yung under eye. Medyo kita. I have another eye ano, what's it called this? Pro Conceal and Correct Palette from MAC. better. <sighs> okay. Next is the powder. Powder, powder. For the powders, I'm using Makeup Forever. I used to have MAC also. But, uh, usually, those are the two brands that I use. So, ito naman pang powder brush. minsan kailangan mo i-mix yung dalawang powder para to get the desired color that you want. Kasi yung iba masyadong dark. Mumukha ka namang na sunburn on screen. So, you have to balance it out also. So, I'm using two shades. Yan. Dalawang shade. Minsan pag ano, yung mga ibang makeup artist na minsan natutusok yung mata mo. <laughs> so, uh, as a makeup artist, you have to be careful also if you're doing someone's makeup. Hindi pwede masyadong rough yung hands. So, almost done. Ganun, ganun kasimple lang yung makeup ko. Hindi pareho na, well, sa mga babae, mas, mas mahirap gawin eh. Sa lalaki, medyo simple lang. Basta may powder lang, hindi lang masyadong shiny yung mukha natin. Okay. After that, we do a little uh, contouring para hindi mo ang flat yung face natin sa TV. So this one, I use the Benefit. If you want to bring out the bridge of your nose, contour mo konti para hindi lang masyado ano, may light and shade you know? and then also for your cheeks and the jawline para makita lang yung ano. so dito sa forehead konti masyado kasi baka pag masyadong dark mukha ka naman may sukat <laughs> mukha ka nabugbog okay and after that we do the last thing we do is uh, loose baking powder baking and setting powder I'm using the Huda Beauty Huda of course it's a brush This balances out all the makeup that you put on your face. Kasi pag sobrang dark, ito medyo nakakabawi. Okay. Almost done. Konti na lang. Hirap mag makeup. Ang daming gagawin. And the last thing that we do 
is I put on the Prep and Prime by Mac Fix Plus para hindi ma mabadal mabilis mapura yung ano makeup. Para mist lang you put it on your face para hindi siya ano hindi mabilis mabura yung makeup and then let it dry air dry yung iba may electric fan ako kamay na lang okay so we are done with our makeup that's it for me yun lang ang ginagawa ko mabilis lang uh, medyo matagal lang because of explaining it to you pero usually wala namang wala pang 30 minutes I'm done uh, usually, when I do makeup naman sa set, ganun din. Mula pang 30 minutes. Pag lalaki, mas mabilis. Mabae talaga, mas maraming uh, kailangan gawin. Mas maraming arte. Ang lalaki, mas uh, simple lang. Okay? So, after this, we're going to the set. And I'll be showing you where we're going. So, stay tuned. Okay guys, so we are already here. And, uh, kaya ako nag-makeup. Kasi, di ba, sabi ko, mag-guesting kami. Kasama ko dito sa guesting, of course, si Ashley. And you wouldn't believe where we are, guys. Nasaan kami? <laughs> Pili ka na number. <laughs> we are on TV5 today. So, uh, I hope uh, you get to watch this. And we are now in there. Uh, what's this called? Dressing room. Dressing room. <laughs> Patagal ko hindi nakatrabaho. Hindi ko na alam kung anong tawag dito. Dressing room. practice muna kami kasi sasayaw daw kami. Di ba sabi ko, pag matindi na pangangailangan, sasayaw na. Eto na yan. <laughs> inside the studio and uh, <laughs> behind the scenes now. so guys that was a sneak preview of what we did uh, today um, I was just showing you how I did my makeup and then we went to the studio, so what happens next, you'll have to find out by watching Ashley Sandrine's vlog. So, if you haven't yet, please like, share, and subscribe, and I hope you like this vlog. See you soon!